Today's vlog, it's great to see you all and happy Australia Day for yesterday to everyone watching in Australia. I know there's a few of you uh, and happy Burns Day to those from Scotland for Monday, which I forgot as well. So I learned a lot about Australia Day yesterday. I hope I will tell you more about how I learned a lot about Australia Day sometime in the future. But today we are back for the second round of matches and I've decided that to save time and to save this series of the Alto mouthpiece sheet going on for about six months, I am going to do four mouthpieces today, two rounds. I'm going to do mouthpiece C versus mouthpiece D, mouthpiece E versus mouthpiece now, as I said before, you can't actually vote anymore like we did for the tenor mouthpiece shootout on YouTube in terms of clicking a link. So what you need to do is just in the comments box below, you need to tell me two results today. You can either say D and F, uh, damn it, Dan, D, F. Good, good choice. Um, I don't know, I need to look at other things. But what I'm saying is, just vote below, I'll collate the results. Likewise, on Instagram and Twitter, you can vote easier there. But as for the last round, for the first vlog in this series of the Alto Mouthpiece Shootout, the clear winner was Mouthpiece B. So that will go through to the quarter-final stage, uh, where it will face off against a random draw. Do you think we should do a draw like the FA Cup? I know most of you probably haven't got a clue what the FA Cup is, but basically I do a draw out of the hat, or do I just randomise it and you guys will accept it as it moves along? Let me know. We can maybe make it a little bit more interesting with a random draw. Uh, but mouthpiece B will go through. So today we're going to do C versus D, E versus F on the same pieces, the same idea, same me, same read. Let's go for it. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
Mouthpiece C against D, please vote for C versus D. And mouthpiece E versus F. Don't give me C. <laughs> don't don't choose between the four of them. I need you to be C versus D, E versus F. Put your comment below uh, and it'll be included in the vote. And uh, I'll also put it uh, on Twitter as well. So make sure you follow me at Dan Forshaw on Twitter. I'm not going to bother with Instagram. Uh, it's there anyway. But um, yeah, really interesting playing those. I just realised I need to take that one out of shot. <laughs> you don't know which one it was though, do you? Uh, anyway, um, let's move on. <laughs> 